it's your girl Shanti, and I'm sorry it took me so long just to make a video. You know, sometimes life be life, and okay. But I'm back, and I'm brand new, and I'm back on YouTube. I'm sorry, y'all. I've been on TikTok. I've been working, I've been on Snapchat, I've been on Instagram, I've been on Facebook, but I did not forget about YouTube, but I just have not been posting on YouTube because when you gotta do YouTube, you gotta do long videos. It don't have to be like too long, but long enough. You get what I'm saying? But y'all, <laughs> y'all, okay, I'm back, okay? Don't judge me. I know it's been a month, I know. The last video, I did a little tour of my apartment. I had to also get that together. I didn't get all the furniture just yet though, y'all, cause you know, bills, you gotta pay the bills and then you can get the materials later, okay? Cause all that furniture stuff is just materialistic things and we don't need that, okay? Um, I hope you guys like my hair. I just got my hair done like, mm, I wanna say two weeks ago. I got me some boho braids, the short, shorter ones. Okay, so yeah. Um, and also got my lashes done, okay? The girl out here, she be hooking me up. Okay, Sonatica, I love you so much. Your mom, Latoya, I love you so much, okay? Um, but yeah, y'all, you know, it's been a rough rodeo since I've moved, like, you know, adjusting to a change and new things and a new work environment. Yeah, it's been hard, you know? Let me turn this light on so y'all can see me. It's been hard, you know, life has been life thing, okay? It's been life -ing. Sometimes it hits you and it hits you hard, okay? So, you know, I don't let that discourage me and stop me from doing what I do best, you know. I'm that girl and I'm always gonna be that girl that I know my worth, respectfully, okay? And I'm also pretty much making this video because I was gone and I wanna let you guys know that I'm still here and I'm still gonna be making content. I just fell off a little bit, but I'm back and I'm brand new and YouTube is my life and that's my number one goal, okay? I've always wanted to be a YouTuber and to finally actually be a YouTuber, I'm sticking to it and I'm not giving up. I'm not gonna do what I did last time and did disappear on everybody, okay? But yeah, this is why I made this video because I wanna let you guys know that I'm still here. Oh, I know you guys hear that thunder. It is about to rain. We don't really get that much rain since I've been here. We haven't been getting that much rain, but we're about to get some now, so that's good. Um, But yeah, so today's my day off, so I finally was able to make a video. I was in training for a long time. We didn't have no days during the week off, just the weekends. But now I have one day during the week off, which I schedule my appointments. I can edit my videos and I can vlog. So I'm gonna try to see if I could do a vlog at least once a week. If not, it's okay, because it's not always good to post all the time, all the time, because you have a life and you're human. You get what I'm saying? So. I just want to put that out there and let you guys know that I am here and I'm back and I'm brand new. I know Jalen's about to get out of school soon. He get out of school at like 2.30. Okay, so he get out of school at 2.30. You don't get home until like 3. But I do 11 hour shifts, y'all. So I work from 8 a.m. to 7 p.m. It's the longest shifts I have ever done in a long, long time. So bear with me, cope with me. This is a new environment. This is a new change. I'm loving South Carolina. I like the apartment. It's nice. But the only thing that we've been dealing with was roaches and rats, okay? So I put down mothballs. Um, the corners of the rooms and the closets is like plugged. But we have the baby mice. And I feel like the baby mice is coming through this little thing. Because I've seen on YouTube that little baby mice can come right through the wall and come right through these sockets. So they have to plug those sockets. That's one thing. But we only have one maintenance man, y'all. We have one maintenance man in our apartment complex and he's only one person. So I'm not even gonna judge him. You get what I'm saying? I'm not gonna judge nobody because nobody's perfect. And sometimes life be life in. So, you know, I'm gonna wait for him to plug that up. Um, and I'm gonna still see if I can find some more stuff. I did catch two mice, little baby ones, on the trap in the closets in the living room. I threw those out in the dumpster outside. But yeah, y'all, the apartment's nice. It just has a little bit of roach and mice problems, okay? And I'm quite sure a lot of people out in this world have the same problems that I'm going through. I'm trying to resolve the issue. They're trying to put me in a different apartment. Um, but I have to sign some papers before I do that. And we don't have a property manager. The property manager is gone. She's finito. Um, we don't never really keep a property manager is what the neighbors were telling me around here. So, yeah, there's a lot of things that I walked into. But that sounds like a personal problem, not a Ashanti tribe problem, okay? And um, 
on top of that you know I did change my career you guys know I am originally a CNA I always have my work scrubs on I was thinking about doing that for a second job which I could do the second job for like overnights or something I'm not really sure yet I'm still thinking about it you know so I can get extra money in my pocket so I could make payments towards certain things or whatever the case may be even though I get paid on YouTube and my platforms and yada 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 but I'm gonna show you guys um, my little workstation. Um, yes, I work from home. I like it. As long as I got my peace and my quiet and stuff like that. So I have a, a, one thing I have to tell you guys. Okay, so I did try to get a desk and I did try to get the little chair, you know, the little work desk station or whatever the case may be off Facebook Marketplace, right? So I text the person that said, yeah, I'll buy this um, desk and chair for like $75, right? All right, so then she said, oh, you, you could come on this day. This was on a Thursday. I said, okay, I'll come at this time because she wanted me to come at that time. I said, okay. And once that time came, I said, what's the address? Didn't get a response. Okay, so I let that slide. Second time. She said, oh, I'm so sorry. I was busy. Um, I was wondering if you could come today. And this was on a Friday, y'all. Friday. And she was like, um, meet me at such and such time. So I said, okay, I'm going to come. I said, what is the Addy? Didn't get a response, okay? So I'm like agitated, okay? You already flopped me out on Thursday, then you try to flop me out on Friday. What's next? I need this desk, you know? It's a cheap deal, It, you know, it saves me money, and I needed something because I was sitting on this tote for my training class, and I had a little table right here. This is my little corner. This was my little corner. But, yeah, so, and, and then Saturday came, you know, she said, I'm so sorry about those Thursday and Friday. I've been wrapped up. I got kids. I work a lot. I said, it's okay. I understand because I'm a mom myself and I work myself. You get what I'm saying? So the third time, she said, okay, I'm going to give you my number this time. So I'm like, okay, this is real now. You're giving me your cell phone number. Okay, this is real. So after she gave me her cell phone number, she gave me her cell phone number. I said, okay, this is good. This is, she's actually giving me a number that I can contact her. She said, meet me at six. But something told me to have one of my friends come with me, okay? Because I don't trust nothing off of those type of sites anyways. But it was cheap and it was a good deal. I was always going to bring somebody with me from the start. I wasn't going to go along because I don't know people, people crazy. And a lot of people know me from YouTube and social media. And might be out to get me, okay? I already got cursed out on one of my lives on TikTok. So, yeah. Um, but, yeah, like, you know, so that was pretty much that situation and then she told me to meet her at six and i had my friend come get me so we both can go over there and once six o'clock came i try to call try to text no response but she gonna listen she's gonna text me on a sunday say oh i'm so sorry again i say you know what forget it forget it nobody got time to be getting the run around nobody got time for that okay i'm trying to work i'm trying to get my stuff situated before i start this 11 hour shifts okay but since that didn't work out, I had a compromise. You guys know what confirmation is. You guys know sometimes in life you gotta compromise. So I set up my workstation right here. Okay, so this is my little workstation. And I find this chair very comfortable. It's hot up high. We have everything up here. Got the glasses, got the notes, got the mouse, got the uh, sticky notes over here, got the camera. We don't have to go on camera though unless it's something that's going wrong in our background and somebody complained about it, then that's about it. But and then we used it for the training class, which wasn't so bad. And then we got our headset here and, you know, you got to plug the monitors and stuff up to the Wi-Fi. Got the Wi-Fi here. So this is a nice little area, too. Plus, the kids won't be able to touch this or anything. So that's good. And then I got the window there just in case I want to look out the window, catch some space during my lunch breaks or my regular breaks, 15, 10-minute breaks. Um, so that's pretty good. That worked out for me, you know, this little workstation not so bad it's not like an actual desk desk but it's something for now instead of me sitting on that tote so yeah y'all y'all want to know my life this is my life i've been busy i'm sorry i love you guys so so much i've been posted on every platform but not youtube but i love you guys though for real like you know i know i gave you guys a little tour but this is my living room again y'all this is my little workstation this is my living room um, I know you guys see what the house look like, but I just want to show you guys a little bit more of what I have in store right now, what it's looking like. But, you know, I've been just trying to get to this money, trying to take care of myself, trying to take care of these kids, get my life together because I do want to buy a house. This is why I came to South Carolina to start my life, start my new chapter. And I'm so happy, y'all. I'm so happy I did a thing. I followed my goals. I chased my dream and I did it all by myself, even though I was a little nervous. But I've always been that type of person to just go get what I want to get.
get just go get and go do what I want to do you get what I'm saying like I'm so proud of myself and I'm so glad that I had that ambition in me just to go and get what I need to get just go out there and do what you got to do and um, I've always been that way I'm an Aries those of you guys that don't know I am an Aries and I'm gonna get what I want to get I'm gonna go reach the goal that I'm trying to reach too so yeah, y'all, you know, so that's pretty much it. You know, Jay was about to get home. I'm going to help him with his homework. I mean, you know, his schooling has been good. He's been good. But the thing with his school right now is that they've been calling me for meetings and stuff because they said that some of the stuff is not, like, registering in his brain, which they got to understand. We're not from here. We're from New York. So the stuff they, they learn out there is not the same learning out here. And I feel like they need to respect that. Honestly, they need to respect it, okay? Give them some time. And plus, school starts early out here. School starts in July. We start school in September, okay? So up north and down south is two different, you know, two different lanes, okay? It's like going in the fast lane and going in the slow lane, okay? It's two different things. You can't compare it. So, um, but yeah, y'all. Um, I just wanted to make this video to let you guys know that I love you guys and I'm here and I'm showing face. I had to show face today and it's been a very, uh, you know, it's been a lot going on, okay? There's too much for me to even vlog, but I'm here and I just want to let you guys know that I'm going to keep on posting as much as I can. Sometimes life gets the best to you. Sometimes you got to okay sometimes you just gotta keep it going okay just keep going and going and going, and going until you can't go no more okay but i do love you guys and i know i gotta make a couple more videos because i got some products and stuff that i be getting in the mail from tiktok that i have to promote um one of these little products i have to promote it's electric razor for women and you know you could use it for the bikini and underarms face whatever you need to use it for they send some really good products so i do gotta promote that you guys know i'm a tiktok ambassador and a youtube ambassador and a herpes dating ambassador i'm ambassador on all different platforms honestly except for instagram and snapchat so um but yeah y'all i love you guys um it's your girl shanti and make sure you guys stay tuned to our next live video if you didn't subscribe make sure you guys subscribe right now and hit that bell for post notifications it's your girl shanti it's the ashanti tribe and make sure you guys stay tuned to our next lit video she said she don't fuck with me who said that you can't hold that nigga munching he gon' eat me